join me in welcoming your host, Buzz. Thanks, G. Welcome to my show. I'm Buzz. This is my assistant, Rose. And over here are what we call contestants. Let's say hello. Hey, cool. (laughs) Enough. Let's go. Okay, who's got the fastest finger? Let's find out. It's all about speed this time. Answer correctly the fastest and you win the most points. Which of the following is the correct name for the waterway in the picture? (laughs) Oh, yeah! How many children did this queen have? What does this picture show? (laughs) Oh, yeah! In which season do you see this weather? What famous London landmark is this? Oh yeah! What is this Egyptian building called? Time to test your powers of rationality with a little something I call fact or fiction. Listen to the sentence and decide whether you think it's true or false. The blue and orange buttons pick your answer. Look out for an explanation afterwards. A bar chart shows how many of each item there are by the length of the bars. Fact or fiction? The taller the bar, the more items there are. Exclamations may be sentences without verbs. Fact or fiction. Exclamations are special kinds of sentences which may have no verb. There are 1,000 metres in a kilometre. Fact or fiction? 
Mädchen! Someone has their eyes open. The word kilo means a thousand. Raindrops are usually over a centimeter in length. Fact or fiction? Someone's awake. Raindrops are smaller than we think, ranging from 0.2 to 0.7 centimeters. Hmm, that's odd. I don't feel like lying anymore. Let's let's see the positions. Ha <laughs> <Yeah>. ha! <laughs> Ready to launch some pies? It's pie fight time. Only the fastest correct player gets to throw pies in this round. Lose all your lives and you're out. So get those quick fingers ready. Where would you go on holiday to enjoy the sun? Inside. What are people who are born in Australia called? player takes turns picking a subject and you'll answer all questions about them. But there's a mixture of subjects this time. Pick a subject with your buzzer. Player one, time for you to pick a category. Potluck questions could be anything. Change, I love my long-haired dog, said Bob, into the third person. I am the victor once again. Oh yeah! Roger Hargreaves created which characters in a series of books in the 1970s? Player 2, pick a category if you please.
Questions on English. How many lines are there in a couplet? What was the name of the book and TV series that featured these? Player one, I want you to pick a category. Get calculating. The choice is maths. What is a quarter of eighty? Up, up, and away! Oh yeah! A shopkeeper charged three pounds and ninety-five pence instead of three pounds and fifty-nine pence. How much was I overcharged? <laughs> Player two, the choice is yours. Choose. Potluck questions. A mixture. Who are you not likely to find in a pedestrian precinct? <laughs> what is it called when strong winds combine with snow? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Got the top rank. One way to settle it, it's top rank time. This time you need to use all four colour buttons to put the answers in the right order. No need to be fast, just right. Put Henry VIII's advisors into order, starting with the first. Place these towns in order of the furthest from London. Order this experiment for keeping things cold. How can you reorganize this sentence? Here is your ruler, but keep the same meaning.
Can you put these books in the order they were published? Place these World War II events in the order that they happened. Answer questions as quickly as you can to stop your time dropping. If you're fastest, you get extra time added, but be careful. A wrong answer loses you a chunk of time. Once you're out, that's it. Game over. Points! Points! What you want is time, and the more you've scored, the more seconds you win. Make sure you answer quickly as time is constantly dropping. Let's have the first question. On what date did Winston Churchill become Prime Minister? <laughs> Which of the following is the correct meaning of kilo in kilogram? I am the victor once again. Player one, not putting a foot wrong. Mm, oh, yeah. Nice high bars. What do children eat in Chemba Kali in India? I'm taxing your time. You're going to have to pick it up. What is 32 multiplied by 100? <laughs> Player one obsessed with nice high bars. Huh. What is the capital of Scotland? Which of the following describes a correct use of an apostrophe? game just great amazing scenes here <laughs> Rose Rosie awards time who won what well Buzz it's a clean sweep for our winner grabbing the genius cup and the itchy trigger trophy in addition to winning the game and player two the prize for the most consistently rubbish answering is yours. Here's the wooden spoon. 
OK, now it's prize time. Buzz, what's our winner taking home today? It's a hot air balloon. Twin propane burners, custom... Hey, hey, hey. hey. <laughs> She's keen to get going. OK, so- someone get me down! Hello and welcome to Buzz. What would you like to play? 